What's going on guys? I am headed to Movie Trading Company to get my hands on that uh, Funko Pop Man at Arms. It's a, uh, some sort of, I don't want to say fall exclusive, specialty exclusive? Is that, is that a thing? A specialty exclusive? I don't think so. I think I'm just making stuff up at this point. But um, a friend just texted me said, hey, I know you like He-Man. Uh, they got this men in arms here. You need to come pick them up. So I'm on my way to, to get him and to see what else they may have. Um, I haven't been here in about a month. And the last time I came, I got that freaking sweet um, John Wick 2 chase. I got that and I got, what was it, what was it, an Aries, was it an Aries, I, I think that's what it was, because I picked up a few, uh, one for myself and, and, and two for uh, friends and such, but um, yeah guys, there's usually some pretty good stuff at this uh, movie trade company, and I think I bought like a Figma for like 20 bucks, or 15 bucks, or something like that a few months back. Um, and then also, uh, I don't know, other crap. It's just a bunch of crap. So anyway guys, let's go check out this movie trade. All right, guys, so I am back from Movie Trading Company, and I got some really, really good stuff. So um, if you're on my Instagram, you probably already saw this guy because I got the Masters of the Universe, Man at Arms, Funko Pop uh, Specialty Series. That's what it was, Specialty Series. So um, I'm not huge into pops. I do have, you know, I don't, I don't not a lot maybe maybe 15 not too many but i just love the ones that uh get all nostalgic for and stuff but you can see the castle gray skull the uh, brick wall and man at arms and then on the back you have he-man and uh she-ra and skeletor and spikor and uh hordak which i need that hordak i'm probably gonna get all of them to be honest with you so i was very excited to uh, pick him up so thanks mr chris good for um letting me know that he was in stock i appreciate that um 
And then I went ahead and got some retro gaming goodness. I got The Adventures of Tom Sawyer complete in box for only $10. So that's a really good deal, guys, um, especially for these older NES games. Um, even the crappier titles for 10 bucks complete is you have to pick that up. You have to pick that up. So um, I'm excited about that. And then um, the um, super fine that I got that I am just freaking digging so much, especially since it's Halloween time. This fits in perfect. I got the Muppets Uncle Deadly. <laughs> freaking awesome so um uncle deadly and this is a um exclusive from uh i can't even read that oma oma something.com oma oma siphano oma syphilis.com i don't know but anyway pretty sweet comes with uncle deadly uh the ghost and the uh, skeleton head so that is sick i love the muppets um you can collect them all but um, these guys are, they're not cheap. They are not cheap, especially this uh, Palisades uh, line they had. They are pretty, they're a pretty penny these days. So I'm very excited to grab this, Uncle Deadly. Now, I said this in my, one of my, uh, what was it, the, the Star Wars freaking Force Friday 2 video. I am planning on going to stand in line for maybe an hour for the Super Nintendo Classic um, that comes out tonight at midnight. I'm going to go to my Walmart, and if I do, you'll know because I'll go ahead and shoot a little footage. Um, I don't want to go to the, you know, Toys R Us, they're supposed to have a lot, but just on all of their uh, midnight releases on whatever it's been... I've always had crappy luck, so I'm gonna try mine, uh, my good old Walmart down the street. So hopefully, I can score on that. And um, if I don't, I'll let you know. And if I don't go, you'll know because there will not be any footage. But anyway, guys, if you're hunting for one, good luck for that. All right, guys. So I'm at Ross, and uh, they have some uh, the Marvel 12 inch uh, scale, like the Iron Man and uh, the Spider-Man and the Captain America on sale for like $12.99. And then they have the Iron Man 2-pack. I think it's War Machine and Iron Man himself. I think that's $12.99. And uh, I've been seeing some other stuff come out of Ross lately. I haven't had a really good reason to come to Ross lately, but th those are two reasons to for me to stop in today. So let's go check that out. All right, guys, so I'm at Ross. And um, see some Star Wars Rogue One stuff. Here's a oh, Legends uh, Falcon. Oh, snap. There's like three of these. Very, very interesting. That's a pretty good price. They got these vinyl idols for $3.99, which is that's pretty good too. This bad girl. Let's see what else we can find. I don't see anything crazy. Minecraft. No, thank you. Pretty sweet. Three ninety nine for that Superman. Um, Halo gun. The Needler. Not seeing any of those uh, the Legends. But I'm thinking on those uh, Black Series. It's like seven dollars a figure. It's a pretty good deal. Alright guys, now I'm going to Toys R Us. I'm going to see if they have those uh, Pulp Fiction figures. Um, so let's go check it out. Alright, so we are in TRU. And look who it is. <laughs> this guy was just calling me. What'd you find? You got him? Yeah, I got... Oh, they got him. They got him? You got to get him? Yeah. 15 bucks? Yeah. 
Duh. I mean, was it wasn't it more than these three? Yeah. Well, they have the like the deluxe pack with the diorama pieces, but I think this is. Oh, um, Toys R Us never gets a deluxe pack. Yeah. I had to do the same thing. To go for, to the, um, like the comic shops and stuff. Yeah. Do you think freaking geeks will have them? Or do they do? No. Well, I did. I was about to claim because of these. This guy. Oh yeah, that came in. I don't know if I should get that instead. Woo. I like how it comes in a good, good yeah. guys box. Now look at this now. The accessory pack. But That's I awesome. Ah. Get no. Get in front. Yeah, I saw that one. Oh, every year, but yeah. They can have one made for twenty bucks. Yeah. So these are probably going to be gone soon. Oh man, that's pretty sweet. I don't know. What do I do? Ooh. You see the guns? I know, I've been eyeballing them. <laughs> Usually comic book stores don't have them yet. Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't there. I want, I want oh. jewels. I want jewels. New iPhone? It's, you get it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Man. It's, it's, it's an off-centered. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't oh. get a new case? No. I was got to, but since my case, it's funny. Uh, this is, I don't know, man. The other ones didn't make that sound. No. But that'd be annoying after one. Man. Is it bad that I don't want Butch? <laughs> you don't want Butch? I don't know. Sword School? Which is the that better than is um, a tasty beverage? I don't know. I'm with you, Marcel. Marcel is his I mean, sweet. definitely got to get uh, Jules. Yeah. Did you, are you still at recording? The at the uh, New, New York. York. We saw these first. We saw them first and they told us not to record them. But I did anyway. But you did anyway. But I never put that picture up. That's why I don't record anymore. I'm lazy. And my camera's upside down. I like this set. Okay. That's not bad. Yeah, that's a sweet set. I just don't, the scale on that, too. Well, it looks more cartoonish, doesn't it? Yeah. I got these at Target for 25 let me guess, price matching? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know it. You are the king of price matching. Some say it is so. Uh, I'm dropping shit. What else? Where do you get this one? I know, once it goes down. Oh, 75. Like 300 pounds. Super heavy. So we were on our way out, we saw these guys, which is kind of a a new addition over here at our TRU. Um, yeah. Man. They are pretty cool. The only ones I know are these three. Oh, yeah. These two. I don't know any of them. Man. I'll sell them home. Then they have that dark night. Jeez. What's going on, guys? I am back with an unboxing from uh, Mr. Josh Pence. We did a, a trade about a week or so ago and I got his package in. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. So I know what it is. I'm very excited to um, add him to my Black Series collection. Just gave it away, at least the line. But um, you know, I've had this figure before and I, I don't know what happened. I either traded them or sold them or something. But, um, you know, I didn't care if, th now this one's loose and I didn't care if it was gonna be loose or in package because you know what? <clears throat> I was gonna open them up anyway. And um, so I'm very excited that I have him now. All right guys, so I almost have this box open. So let's go ahead and see what's inside the box. All right, so, Josh hooked it up with a, what is it? What's it gonna be guys? What's it gonna be? Freaking Palpatine. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. So thanks Josh for that buddy. I will uh, be putting them on my Star Wars Black Series shelf here pretty soon. I have a bunch of figures up here I just need to uh, put away. I did this unboxing the other day. 
What's going on, guys? What's going on? But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, if you haven't hit that sub button, go ahead and do that now. I would appreciate it. Hit the like button, guys, anyway. All right, guys, so I'm back from Walmart, and I was able to get the Super Nintendo Classic, if you can see that. But you can't, because I can't even see what I'm doing right now. But I wanted to share this with you guys, because uh, waiting in line for uh, an hour and a half, uh, it was a bit crazy. Um, you know, definitely stood in my share of lines, but uh, a fight broke out in this one. Um, so that was stupid. So that was right behind me. That was going on. That was frustrating. But right in front of me, there was people connecting and people talking about their passion for video games and stuff like that. And that was great. That was great to see. So, you know, bittersweet. But, um, you know, I am home now and mission accomplished. I got my SNES Classic on the first night. So I'm done. Check it off the list. I'm done. I'm out. Peace.